hydrolysis through substitution is the conversion of a halo alkane into an alcohol and there are two ways in which that can be done the first is with sodium hydroxide or potassium hydroxide the specific conditions required for this type of reaction are firstly that the halo alkane must be dissolved in ethanol second there must be water present and sodium hydroxide or potassium hydroxide and the reaction solution must be heated again demonstrated with the triangle underneath the arrow so in this example here we have one fluoroethane that reacts with sodium hydroxide and in the correct conditions these three conditions here what we would find is that the fluorine atom is substituted with the hydroxide the hydroxyl group of atoms to form ethan-1-ol, which is our alcohol, and then the remaining sodium fluoride. The second type of hydrolysis through substitution reaction is with only water, not with sodium hydroxide or potassium hydroxide. The specific conditions for this type of reaction are firstly that the haloalkane must be dissolved in ethanol, same as the previous reaction, and that there must be water present in excess. So in this example we have two chloropropane that reacts with water and when these conditions are met we find that the chlorine atom is replaced or substituted by the hydroxyl group from the water molecule which forms the alcohol propane 2 and then leaves us with HCl.